Hello everyone, welcome back. This is MGS Pawan. In this video, we are going to continue the KSET previous year solved question paper 2018. If you are not subscribed, please do please do like and subscribe to my channel for getting more important updates regarding KSET and uh, solving the question papers. Let's not waste our time. Let's go for question number 35. A particle of mass m and charge e moves in an electromagnetic field described by scalar potential phi of r and the vector potential ar in the c. If c is the speed of the light in the vacuum, the momentum conjugate to the position vector r is. Now here they have asked you to find out the momentum conjugate. So the Lagrangian of a particle uh, in an electromagnetic field is given by the L is equal to 1 by 2 mv square minus q phi r comma t plus q is equal to q by c v a vector of r t which is a function of r comma t so for the finding of conjugate momentum what you have to do is just differentiate differentiate, par, differentiate partially Lagrangian with respect to velocity we are we will you will be ending with the expression mv square sorry momentum p is equal to mv vector mv vector plus qa by c this is a vector here q is equal to e here i have taken the general case of Lagrangian and i have differentiated and uh, here the matching answer is uh, D so option D is the correct one now let's go for question number 36 if light is incident at a boosted angle on a glass lab it result in the production of plane polarized light in the reflection the total internal reflection the production of circularly polarized light in the reflection the production of circularly polarized light in the transmission we know that boosted angle is at a certain angle the incident ray get uh, at a certain angle of incident the reflected ray get suppose it has a polarization in all direction at certain angle when we incident the reflected ray will be plane polarized means it will be polarized parallel to the interface this is the interface and it will be parallel to this means it will be like in and out of the page you can consider and the transmitted ray will be elliptically polarized based on the medium what it, uh, where the light is getting transmitted means it, it it is transmitted elliptically and which is lightly so the correct option is a what is it is the production of plane polarized light in reflection what i have told now let's go for question number 37 the product of uncertainty delta x and delta px for the ground state of one dimensional simple harmonic oscillator is here the options as follows so here the what they have given you have to know is the simple harmonic oscillator so in case of simple harmonic oscillator the product of uncertainty in the position and uncertainty in the momentum will be equal to the h cross by 2 this thing you have to be remembered so let's go for question number 38 if the bore if the bore radius is a naught the most probable value of r is in the ground state psi is equal to 1 by root of pi a naught cube e power minus r by a naught of hydrogen atom is so here they have asked you to find out the most probable value and they have given the sign so for finding the most probable value of r so we have what we have to do is just do the differentiation with respect to r and uh, i think you can do this differentiation and we get this d psi by dr is equal to zero and you will be end up in with r is equal to a naught next let's go for question number 39 the total number of energy eigen function psi minimum r theta and phi corresponding to the same energy level en 
without considering the spin according to non relativistic quantum mechanics in the case of hydrogen atom here the, the keyword is non relativistic case in the case of non relativistic case we will having the total number total energy level will be n square no i think this no need an explanation you can remember this you have to know this the wave function of a particle is given by let's go for question number 40 the wave function of a particle is given by del x minus x naught the uncertainty in the momentum delta px is firstly see the the given fun, given wave function is del of x minus x naught it is a delta function in case of delta function we have the it has a property as 1 when x is equal to x x is equal to x naught 0 and x when x is not equal to x naught so we know that when we measure the uncertainty in the position exactly yes uncertainty in the position and uncertainty in the momentum is h, h cut by 2 if you measure the position accurately means uh, if you measure the position with more precise and accurately and we will be having a more uncertainty in the momentum and momentum and okay, momentum so here we have measured the position exactly where it is at x is equal to x naught so we will be getting the momentum infinity so uncertainty in the momentum becomes infinity so our option t is the correct one thank you for watching please do like and subscribe to my channel in the next video i will continue the questions thank you